Hi besties, it's me Paige. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm a little bit late to this reaction, but whatever. As you can see by the title, I'm going to be reacting to SB19's interview with Rappler. Shout out to the people that um, put subtitles on this, English subtitles. I know there's a lot of people working really hard to help with subtitles, especially this era with everything coming out. So thank you guys so much. We appreciate you so much. Like, so much. This is them talking about their new era. I think I've seen a lot of different clips from this interview already, so we're just gonna watch it, pause it, talk about it, all that good stuff. But before we do that, I wanted to say Jasmine will be here on the 16th, which is my birthday, and Stell's birthday, but it's my birthday. So we're gonna do a little live, I think, for mine and Stell's birthday. I'm thinking it's going to be Friday night for us, so It'll be around like 11 a.m. on the 17th in the Philippines, so I'll schedule the live beforehand just so you guys know, but we're just gonna like talk, hang out, maybe like decorate cakes, party. There's gonna be some special guests. So yeah, I just wanted to put that out there, but yeah, and also I can't wait for a tour, guys. I'm so excited. I just got my Chicago tickets in the mail. I still have to buy my New York tickets. Ooh, but also I think I don't know when we're getting our DC tickets. Um, I don't know if they're gonna be physical tickets or what but yeah I'm so excited. Everything is basically booked almost. I still have to buy my flights and everything but that's besides the point. Um, But yeah I'm excited about this. I We are gonna talk about the I Want You music video because it's not time yet and I can't mentally talk about that right now. I can't. I'm not strong enough for that one. Okay let me turn it up. Eee. Okay here we go. Oh, this was the tea of the day. <laughs> why is he acting like this oh my gosh so i feel like this was like the big news of this interview is that they like confirmed that they're their own little like team whatever i actually already knew this i think just by like context clues and there was like a confirmation that we got so like we kind of already knew i'm just so happy for them because if you've been here for a while i feel like you know all of the stuff that happened back in the day we're not gonna like go through it or anything but yeah i'm just happy for them they get to do what they want and i don't know i feel like deserve because nothing's holding them back and they have creative freedom and they all are so creative so i feel like you can really see that compared to when they were where they were at <laughs> but yeah cats out of the bag and i'm so happy for them and proud of them because they're really doing the damn thing all by themselves which is probably such a big transition and they probably have had to learn a lot in a short period of time but love to see it anyways Oh my god, imagine they have like little groups that are like signed to them. That'll be so cute. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. Slay! Still is. Support 
yung talaga nagkakaroon, nagkakaroon ng unity. Kumbaga lahat sumasama dito sa ganito kayo. Kumbaga, kasi nakita ko sila rin yung mga, isa sa mga nagsimula eh, yung challenges. And parang nakaka-overwhelm na, syempre kami minsan, hindi lang na lahat nakikita yung bago, pero lahat sila parang nilatry nila na gumawa lagi ng TikTok, minsan hindi lang isa. And syempre po na natutuwa kami na nag- Girl, we're really trying to make it go viral everywhere. Like, we are, yeah. Pablo, the whole interview, we're happy. Oh my god, so precious. Oh! Guys, when Chachi posted that TikTok, I think I had an out of body experience. I feel like, I feel like a lot of people know who she is, but like, if you don't, you missed out like she was literally my childhood i don't dance but like i was so into dancing back in the day like abdc was my favorite show i would like stay up late at night watching it like when she posted that i was like surely the boys are flipping out and i was because i was i'm like it's not even my song and i'm like crying but oh my god yeah slay <laughs> I feel like if you don't expect something, that's when stuff starts to happen. You know? You can't like push everything to happen. It has to happen by itself. What a dream team. Did you ask them? Did you ask everyone who for this one? For forget though. Oh but uh and look better than main process for it. What let's say not go. As my didn't get up. Oh you want I don't get to something where my didn't come out. I just realized this has his new era. What a slay. I seriously like I think it's because I just have a small brain I can't imagine like making a song from scratch so I'm just always so amazed <laughs> like what do you mean you just think of that Oh, you know what? Like I just said. Like imagine just having that talent. Like my brain could never. My brain could never. Because, like, I thought, 
Well, yeah, a lot of people do it, but not everyone does it well, you know? Oh my god, he's literally giving dad. He's like, all my sons, thank you so much. <laughs> I mean, he did say in the Zach Sang interview that the next one is already conceptualized at least. What is something that you just did in Oh, please say R. Please talk about R&B track. Not the excavator. Oh my god, right, they're live. <laughs> they literally did that? No, I can't. Even the dance literally shut your mouth, Justin. What is wrong with you? Like, what is wrong with you? Part of me, okay, this is how I feel about I Want You. Since we've never seen S19 do this genre, part of me is scared. Because obviously, I know they can do anything. I know anything will suit them. But we've just never seen them do something like this. So I'm like nervous. But I'm just nervous just because of every single reason. Like R&B, like I know they're going to slay because like, come on, like let's be real. But like I'm a little bit scared. But I'm excited because R&B is like, especially because it's really giving like 90s R&B. Like it's giving, we're throwing it way back like boys to men type vibe what is going on with my hair but yeah no i'm a little bit nervous but why would he talk about the dance right now because like i don't want to see the dance i don't want to see it 
maraming adjustment, maraming new learnings, maraming so maraming kong nangyari talaga. Na makikita nyo sa pagpabalik na. Na makikita nyo po sa mga mga video releases ko na. So, what do you mean? Content. Mention yung ano yung love song. Kasi parang super cool. Oh my god, I'm so excited! I'm assuming this is really hard. Like, I cannot wait, bitch. Yung love songs namin ngayon, yung mga hidden gems na. Hidden gems na for this EP. Ito na lang din siguro yung mga fans kung bakit wala kami love song lagi. Pero kasi po ako, actually madami lang kasing love song sa Filipino industry. Ayun na whole. Sa ibang mundo madami love song. Siguro mas naghuhugot ako dun sa story na experiences na kaya wala ko siya sa love song. Pero for this EP, kaya meron po. Kaya mag gusto ko nila yan kasi gusto ko sa kami. What are they whispering about over there? Talaga. She is just like me for real. <laughs> Not the no reason. We just felt like it. <clears throat> <laughs> Not the puns. Oh my god, okay, it ended so abruptly. I want to say, I feel like by watching this, I'm so intrigued to know the timeline of this album because we know that they were literally talking about it in Zack Sing last year, which was in November. So I don't know, I'm just so intrigued to know like the timeline because when back then, Pablo said it was finished. And so this leads me to think that like they were trying to sort out everything with their old company and either their old company was not letting them release stuff so that they they just had this like in the vault like ready to go but like they had a whole bunch of like maybe legal stuff that they had to sort out that's what i'm guessing happened because like i said they said it was ready like in november and they were even teasing like the third album of like this like little trio that they are planning on doing so i'm really intrigued to know the timeline i'm also really intrigued to know if they like had other songs that they like switched out because if they finished it like last year maybe they had a new song that was written between them they were like oh this has to go on this album you know like i'm so intrigued to know the timeline i hope we get behind the scenes content like i'm I'm begging. I still am waiting for the Wyatt tour vlogs. Like, please, please, I'm begging. I know you guys were filming the whole time. Like, I literally saw it happening. I want those vlogs so bad. So I'm really praying. We still don't have a Gento dance practice, which I feel like they're gonna wait and release the Gento dance practice and the I Want You dance practice like the week after Hectag is like released. So I'm still waiting and I'm still looking forward to it so much. Also, one last thing, I just realized that I have one last dream collab that I wanna see happening when they're in the US and it's them being on Good Mythical Morning. I don't know if you guys know what that is or if you watch it, but I freaking love that show. It's been my like my comfort show for like a long time now and they just did a collab with NTT Dream and they've done one with Jackson Wing. So I'm like, can they like somehow get SB19 on there? Like I'm literally begging. This is me saying it out loud so that I can therefore manifest it because y'all know sometimes I'm really good at manifesting stuff. So we will only hope that this comes true. Thank you so much. Oh, I also wanted to say, I'm gonna be reacting to the I Want You music video right when it comes out, of course, because I cannot wait to watch that. There's no way. Um, but as for the rest of the EP, I'm going to wait a week until I'm with Jasmine. So we're gonna react to the songs that we haven't heard together, okay? Okay, it's gonna be really hard actually for me to wait that long, but as long as I have Gento and I Want You, I think I'll be okay. For the time between <laughs> so yeah just a heads up if you're waiting for my reaction to 
the whole EP. It'll be a week late, but it will be uploaded nonetheless. So just be patient. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope I see you guys on tour. If you're going to any of the dates that I'm going to, let me know. Um, but yeah, thank you for watching. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!